I need help. Help! Help me. They're after me. The sea drakes. When it gets foggy, like last night, they play tricks with the lighthouse. Lure ships aground. The Maiden's Breath, my ship, they lured us in and wrecked us. Drowned or captured. Captain Larissa's looking for them. You heard of crafty Larissa, right? Anyway, I'm through. No more sailing for me. You want to find the captain? Just look for her monkey, Howler. aren't at all what I was expecting. Let's talk. What brings you to this trash pit? Sneak up on you? It's what I do. Now answer my question. What are you doing here? Oh, charming. The maiden's wrecked on the sandy shore. As for crafty Larissa, you found her. Just in time, too. Captain Helene's sea drakes have my crew. I won't leave without them. Help me rescue them, and I'll owe you a favor. We're going to disguise my crew as sea drakes. Take these clothes. Look for a portly Breton, a sour red guard, and a big orc. The drakes are keeping them in the large buildings. Once they're out, meet me by Helene's ship. Look for hampers with clothes, or kill a sea drake and take theirs. Put on their clothes, and you'll look just lovely. Oh, do watch out for the sea drakes with torches. They're not drunk. If you get too close, they'll spot you and alert the others. Remember, you can take clothes from hampers or off-dead sea drakes. Oh, and try not to get killed. Uh, please, don't beat me again! Thank the Eight! I thought I'd die in here! Helene came by not long ago. Told me to look forward to a public flaying. Then she beat me bloody, laughing the whole time! She's one cold witch! Stay away from Helene. She's a monster! Choke and die, Sea Drake. I'll spit on your grave. I knew she wouldn't leave me to rot. Quick, untie me. The Sea Drake spent the past few hours breaking my fingers. I can't wield a sword, but I can still strangle a few on my way out. These Sea Drakes give pirates a bad name. Kill every last one of them you see.
If you're going to kill me, get it over with. Ha. Huh. Another of Helene's tricks. Let me go, then chase me down and beat me within an inch of my life. I'll chance it and make a run for Port Hunding. See how far I get. Word of advice. Don't let them capture you. If you can't get away, die fighting. You're a welcome sight. I've rescued everyone but Crenard, Herdin, and Meekog. Any luck? Almost done then. Everyone's out except my first mate, Deragor. They've got him in the belly of Helene's ship. You'll find the keys below deck. Look for Deragor down and back. Good trick, that. Did I really disguise myself as a fern? Or did you see a fern because you weren't looking close enough? I'll be visiting Helene in her cabin, to thank her for the hospitality she's extended my crew. Come on up after you release Deragor. You should really say hello. Her cabin girl had a key. Poor little Bosmer lass. Barely any meat on her bones. I think Helene was starving her. She's on her way to Port Hunding now, and I'm one key richer. I'm not telling you anything, scum! What have you done with Captain Larissa? Yeah? Ha! <laughs> I knew she got away! Helene said she was being keel-hauled and beaten, but I knew better. They don't call my Captain Crafty for nothing. Get me out of these ropes, and let's get out of here. Captain Larissa never leaves anyone behind. Make sure she's safe. Starving little cabin girl may have poisoned her drink. Who can say? Did Deragor get out? I'll just be going then. I told my crew to gather on the beach. I'm going to make sure they all made it out. Meet me there and we'll square up. I'd feel mildly disappointed, but I leave it up to you. Meet me on the beach once you're done here and we'll settle up. Just watch your boots. She'll start vomiting soon. I'd love to stay and watch, but no time. You can stay if you like. It's actually her poison, kept for slaves who disobey. There's an antidote on the dresser if your heart bleeds enough. 
Oh, it's Yarn Root. A very nasty local poison. It won't kill her. Not right away. It starts by dissolving the stomach lining, then goes from there. My crew's safe, and only a little bit tortured. I call that a win. Well, your choice. I hope the next crew she shipwrecks and murders appreciates your soft heart. The important thing is she knows I had her. She won't cross me again. Now, about our debt. What do I owe you? If the Maiden's breath wasn't rotting on the beach, I'd happily oblige, considering all you've done for us. But no ship, no ride. I do know someone who might give us a job, though. A job that just might get us both off this rock. Come join us at the Screaming Mermaid when you get a chance.